Hey everybody. So, this wreath is going to be a summer wreath. Getting a little jump start on things. Um, I have this really cute Hello Summer watermelon sign that I got from Hobby Lobby. And I'm also going to be using this cloth mesh and I'm going to do the ruffle method and I also have cut some strips of ribbon I'm going to add probably a little of this just to get a pop of green a little tubing and I'm also going to add these pretty rosebuds flowers um and i've got a bow that i have not fluffed out or done anything to yet but it's ready to go as well so let's get started just gonna gather the ends this is some really rough mesh like stiff that's okay. I liked the pattern and it definitely matched well with the colors in the, um, in the watermelon sign. So let's see how this works out. So per usual, I started zip tying it. I need a mat so I can measure out even though I have a pretty good idea where 10 is still all right so let's go up 10 find our first tie and just give it some twists bluff it on out this is weird. It has like a plasticky feel to it. All right. And again, I'll pretend we'll find our next tie. And fluff it out. Yeah, but I do like, that's why I decided not to do any curls or anything, because I really want to show the mesh on this one. work weights that I bought a bunch of because I haven't had to make make one. Yes. And I'll do one more. how that's looking so i'll go ahead and put the rest of the poops on and i'll be back okay guys so we've got done as you can see so now just going to figure out placement of my sign 
and I think I'm going to do this like this. Pull all the mesh up. And then what I think I'm going to do is just use this actual wire that's hanging it and use our tie. I'm going to twist that around and, and make it hold like it should. Twist that right in there. Vicky, be quiet. Sorry, guys, the dogs. And there we go. Hello, Summer. Vicky, no. So now, what I think I'm going to do is make a little curl out of the tube. Just going to save some room. Leave a little out on the tip. In the middle, I mean. I'm just going to go back and forth. I just wanted to add a little bit for a little pop of green in there. And this is the same on both sides. Is it? Yeah, it is. So I'm gonna pinch this in the middle. I'm gonna add it to one of the ties. Like so. And just smooth out a ribbon. pop of color. And I think I'm going to go to the next one and add a rose. I just want to see, make sure I've got enough of everything for everything. Hold on. Maybe that, maybe one of these, maybe one of these, and these. And this would be a flower, and that would be a flower, and that would be a flower. Making sure I have enough of everything. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and glue my little flower petal. Right in there. And I'll do the same for this one.
Let's just go that way. Right in there. Now we'll make another cord. Very simple. Don't want to make it longer than the other one. Pinch this in the middle. Wait for that little tubing. Find a tie. ribbon to point down and this is some cloth ribbon and I went with the cloth ribbon because this is kind of like a cloth so that's what I did there just curve these the right way This one. And then I need another tubing. I think that makes a nice little pop of color too. little shimmer gather this in the center find a tie Twist that right in there. Stop it. Just bending these back a little because when I cover the back, it'll cover that. There we go. Gather this in the center. And add it to a tie.
twist these in to the back. Add a little flower. Perfect. And we just need one more. Never throw out your little scraps, guys. You never know when they come in handy. There we go. Okay, that's what we have so far. And what I think I'm going to do is trim that. And I think for a little extra added something, something. I'm going to take a little teeny piece of wire and cut the inside of my hand, guys. Take this last little bit of tubing. Put it in here. Like so. Take this little bit of wire. Wrap it around. Turn this down. And I'm going to glue that right there. No sense wasting those last little pieces. So we'll put that like that. Then add the flower to the middle. Hold everything in place. Just a little zhuzh. See that? And then we go. Let's figure out where I'm going to put our bow. Fluff it out a little bit. I don't want any 
me see where I want to sit it. So I want it to go right in here. Do I want it at the top? I'm trying to think, guys. That's the top here. Yeah, I guess that's the spot. Okay. So, we just have to wire, wire our bow through the back. So now just fluff it out. And then so I'm gonna turn these tails. Cut off the fray. I think I'll do is just curl these. And then we'll be done. Curl this last one and I think we're done guys. And there we have it. I think it came out cute. And summer. <laughs> Let me know what you think in the comments, guys. Um, I'm really happy with it. I think it came out super cute. Alrighty. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. I'll see you guys for the next one. Have a good day.